Hello guys, we Cars Ed today, Capricorn FF, and welcome to another edition of F122 Career Mode. So, here we are again, after finishing 17th at the Mexican Grand Prix at Autodromo Armando Rodriguez course. Here I am just doing a drift event at Brazil, so, let's put these Pirelli hot lamps, and it's not going to take long, and... I will discuss how my season is going in season three. And as you can tell, you'll be able to see the World Driver Championship point standing at the end of the video clip, so don't worry. Won't take long. So I mean I mean, yesterday I just won the NASCAR Cup race at Richmond, so if you're in the States and you want NASCAR, good for you. And, I mean, NASCAR and F1 are similar in some ways, but they're drastically different because of the weight of the stock cars, which is 3,400 pounds. F1 cars are around 1,100 pounds lighter. So don't correct me if I get the calculations incorrect, because... I rarely watch F1 races because in the States I have to wake up like 8 or 9 in the morning to watch it and I don't have cable so in the And for Sebastian Vettel retiring, I don't think I'll watch another F1 race again unless Michael Schumacher's uh, son, Mick, gets a uh, Ride for Ferrari, which I think he's gonna try to do, but yeah, Carlos Sainz is doing okay on Ferrari, so his seat might be secure. Charles Leclerc, Lando Norris, George Russell, they have the top seats in their respective teams, so. and plus, don't forget Max Verstappen, too. <laughs> So here is one more lap around uh, Brazil at Interlagos. Let's see how many I have. 4,391 points. So I don't really say the actual uh, stat number for <laughs> drift events, but anyways, it's not going to be easy, you know. Sorry. Sorry guys, I'm sitting on a bed and my right leg's going to sleep. <laughs> I mean, I'm on... Just to let you guys know, from, from my channel, I'm insane right now, celebrating my niece's sixth birthday, so I'm not in my uh, current house back in the East Coast, so. <sighs> I don't have much to say, but <laughs> it's been an exhausting few weeks, so. Trying to get ready for school and all that, and knowing that online gaming will be at a minimum at the most, so don't expect much YouTube uploading for a while, so. So if you guys want to watch the rest of this video, go right ahead, since I'll be in the Brazilian Grand Prix, and, and as the title says, I'll make an early retirement at Brazil. Because of an unknown start in the race, so the spoiler alert, it really happened, but so anyways, give a thumbs up button if you like the video so much, share a comment right below in the description for people in the community, and click on that bell notification button so you can get more future videos from my channel, Carla95, so. 
I'm Jordan FF. Y'all have a great day and peace out. Position of lap one, that's not great, but it's not terrible. Stay focused.
DRS when you're within one second of the car ahead and in the DRS zone. remaining now.
And now let's take a look at the driver's standings. It's a great result for David Coulthard who moves further ahead at the top of the table. Nothing can challenge the leaders in the Constructors' Championship at this point, but it's another clear win for Mercedes. That was a heck of an impact. Let me know you're okay. And so the celebrations begin, and well earned they are indeed. It might have looked simple at times, but as any racing driver will tell you, competing at this level at the very top is anything but simple. There's no catching them now then. We have a new World Drivers' Champion. That's a spectacular victory. Some amazing talent out on the track today. But Anthony, who would you pick as your driver of the day? Often my go-to would be a driver who's managed to pull off an escape. We've got an issue with like you know, in Thanks. I appreciate you taking the time to help out. So we're coming to the end of my YouTube video right now, so give a thumbs up button if you like the video so much, click on that bell button to subscribe for more content, and if you saw the recent video interesting, share the comment right below the description so you can share some thoughts and feelings with everybody in the community and make them feel welcome. So I make a happy Corona 95, you'll have a great day and peace out.